remember he had a couple of uh, pretty much night fights with PSU and uh, Moorhead State where it was real hard. How, uh, how much better was this one tonight? It looked like y'all were able to score pretty easily. Uh, I say, you know, we, we had those two off days, well, two rest days, Monday and uh, Sunday, and we came in today, you know, and was locked in. You know, Coach Matt told us we should be re well rested. And we came out, you know, played as a team, hard 40 minute game, and, you know, we did what we had to do to execute and win. So. Trey, is there a layup that you can't make? Uh, you go up with the most athletic layups, it's Kyrie Irving esque in a way. Is there a shot that you can't make right now? Uh, well, I just try to like you know like try to get more consistent, really, with my mid range, and my three bar right now. But finishing around the rim, that's one of my main strips. And you know, past couple of games, I've been missing you know like dunks, layups, things like that. So I've been trying to you know be more consistent, you know, and just finish around the rim strong and not go up soft. So, but Trey, ever since you got here, you've been very effective coming off the top of the key, going to the basket. Yes, sir. Is that a move you've always had, or is that something you've really worked on since you've been here? Uh, really, you know, since high school, you know, growing up, it's just getting downhill, you know, creating. If I can't create for myself, create for others, you know. That's just my type of game, getting downhill and, you know, creating and getting to the rim. Well, I guess with the uh, big crowd and the ESPN thing, some things might have been a little more nervous. You guys seem to very, be very at home with that tonight. Oh, uh, yes. I mean, it was no pressure for us. And, you know, just that's just our, our team chemistry, you know. Everybody, you know, gel together. We play together. So that really just motivated us, you know, go out there and play even harder in, on national TV. So just blessed to get the win. Now we're on the UT Martin. So. You guys don't really let the national noise get to you. You're just really focused on what's at hand, right? Correct. Yeah. Uh, we just try to stay focused. Like Coach Max says every day, we try to win the week every, you know, one and know every day. And, you know, just come out and play hard every game. Like we got that chip on our shoulder. So. Trey, you guys shot 65% in the first half. You think maybe that'll cool down. Instead, you guys shot 64% in the second half and shot 64 for the game. What was the offensive game plan against Austin P, which typically plays a lot of man to man? Uh, it really was execute. You know, they coming off every screen. You know, Coach Matt just told us, you know, get downhill. Like like I said earlier, and coming off screens, especially with Tevin Brown. You know, they that's our glue guy, so they are gonna pressure him mainly. So just. Executing and knowing our reads and things like that, and just working together. So, the last six weeks, what are you seeing out of KJ Williams? I mean, I know the numbers are there, but as a player who's coming around his screens and then watching him score at will, what's it like as a player on the sideline? Uh, you know, KJ KJ's been getting a lot of like backlash. So, I but you know, we everybody in our locker room knows he's the best big in this league. But every every night he has to go out there and prove that, and that's what he's been doing in practice. You know, getting extra work in. So. You know, in my eyes, he's the best big in this league, you know, as, and it's fun playing with KJ. So hopefully we continue that. I meant to ask him, but why is he mean mugging on every basket that he makes? He has to. <laughs> Not in a mean way, but it's kind of like he has, a, he has to play with that chip on his shoulder. Like, he's been doubted a lot, and, you know, we depend on KJ. So I know he'll keep it up. So ready for Saturday.